All right, so um, in the uh, spot that I'm pretty much always in nowadays, um, wanted to show really quick, by the way, Beard is coming back almost uh, almost two weeks now. Almost two weeks in, yeah. Um, so I wanted to show you what I got. Uh, it came in, which my Gizmo Duck finally came in, and um, I will tell you this. Um, I will tell you quite a bit, actually, but I will start with telling you this. Um, Target. I don't know how it is for everybody else, but they have stepped up their game with getting these pops to you in one piece. I don't know if anybody else got like the whole um, wrapping around the, the pop itself in a little box that definitely didn't move around that much. Just really impressive. Um, it's really cool to see whenever you have, you have some type of, you know, big corporation you know, really trying to get this thing to you and understanding that the box is very important. You know, I think that's really cool. Um, maybe I just got lucky and they sent it in this, but I've, I've, I've ordered from them before. My, uh, my, <clears throat> my magma trooper came and it was a little d dinged out from hitting stuff, but this guy was really well uh, packaged. I was pretty impressed. Now, the pop itself, I love it. It's actually much better than I thought it would be. I, I mean, I figured it was going to be really nice, but I was like, okay, you know, I, I know people are always like, I like this pop. This pop's not, doesn't even really look like a pop, you know? Well, I mean, I like it when the pop looks like a pop. That's why I collect pops. But, um, it doesn't really look like a pop, but I like it. I really, I'm really digging it. I really do. And obviously that's the line in the back, all the different ones that you could get. Which one am I, what I would be wanting to get the most doesn't show in here would be um, Gizmo Duck. That's the one that I would want the most. That's who I got. So I'm very, very freaking happy about that. Yes. All right. So I just want to show that. And also I got another infinity figure. <sighs> Looks like this is going to be my new black hole because, well, actually maybe not because I heard that they're not making them anymore. So I don't know if I'm going to be running into these very much or where they even have them at. I know Toys R Us for sure. But other than that, I think it's like a dollar at Toys R Us right now if you can find them. I know I'm going to go after Kylo Ren, Darth Maul, who else? Vader, and uh, Black Panther. Yeah, I'd be happy with those. I'd be happy with those. Oh, and uh, I think Black Suit Spider-Man too. Be cool with that one too. Venom too. Okay, I could just keep going. Anyways, I got um, Vision. Oh, it just... The glare is so bad. Sorry, but there's, there's, there's vision. There we go. Let me see. How close can I get without it shining? There it is, right there. There's vision, and um, really cool pop. I'm mean, pop. Listen to me. Really cool infinity figure. Um, the detail is crazy on these things, and I wish I wasn't so late to the game or passed them up so much. But um, I don't know if you can see that real good. But there's, there's the different ones you can collect, right there. And yeah, so um, I heard that there actually might be some type of articulated figures coming out. I don't know if they're actually going to be called infinity figures or not, but I did hear they would be coming out and that is cool. That is awesome. It's very cool. Um, so yeah, I'll put this one over here for right now. I And um, last thing I'm going to mention before we get into the hunt is, I have it open already, there is those that like pops, I know not everybody likes pops, everybody thinks it's the, it's the, you know, I think it's the, by the way, I know everybody thinks it's the beanie baby of, of now, and I, I think so too, you know, but people still collect beanie babies, they do, Google it, anyway, so, um, there's new wave of Harry Potter coming out, Austin Powers is gonna get a wave, um, Baby Driver, um, Deadpool is going to get more, uh, I think Robe Deadpool, Clown Deadpool, uh, Halo's coming back out, which is good, I think there will be a chase in that one, there's probably a chase in all of these, Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, that's another one that's going to be coming out, that's really cool, and, uh, The Mask, and you can, oh, and by the way, where I'm finding these all at is popvinyls.com. You can go to popvinyl.com. You know, like, uh, Pop Price Guide's really good for if you're trying to keep track of your, your collection and stuff like that. But Pop Vinyls, I feel like it's just a really better, um, which I'm sure there's other better ones out there. So if you got a better one than that, awesome. 
but for me, I use pop vinyls because they seem to be pretty up to date. The, 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 what I want to get to though, thing I am the most excited about, by the way, there's unmasked Spider-Man, uh, white Spider-Man, whatever that is. And then uh, negative Spider-Man, Mr. Negative Spider-Man, um, Miles Morales, Spider-Man, uh, Mary Jane, plushy or plush. Mary Jane plush. I thought it was about pop. Maybe it's a plush. Is there such thing as a plush pop? I don't think so. Um, and uh, I sidetracked. I'm most excited about this because I've said this before. Um, I don't think I said it on camera. Maybe I did a long time ago. But when someone asked me or I was asked, I think I, I addressed it on camera, what pop I wish that Funko would make. I said I wish they would make Coming to America pops because I love that movie. It's my favorite movie of all time. Um, I try to watch it a couple of times a year just because it takes me to my happy place. And it's a great movie. You should really watch it. Just a great movie. Um, and I and I said, like, you know, I wanted po Coming to America pops, and they're going to come out. They're coming out with uh, Coming to America. I don't know how many different ones are in the waves. It looks like there's two, which... Um, let me see, where is it? I can't find it now, but it's it's somewhere in there. But yeah, Coming to America Pops are coming out. I'm not sure. I know there's two for sure, but I can't remember. Uh, obviously, obviously they've got to do the Prince. They've got to do um, they got to do Akeem. They got to do um, well. Really, Akeem was pretty the biggest one. I think his dad would be a cool pop too. I'd like like to get that. One. I just got done saying no more commons, no more common pops in my last video, and here I am. Like if they're commons, I'm gonna get them. But I did say you know, a while back that that is like the, one of the top pops that I definitely would need to pick up if they made. So yeah, anyways, let's get to the hunt. Right central. Let's check clearance first. Right next to the knives. Got something for everybody over here. All right, that's it for clearance. Oh no, behind me. 11 bucks, 11 bucks. 20. Big old My Little Pony for 129. This thing's 84. I don't know what it is, but it's heavy. 30, $33. Oh, here you go, 25. Is that, is that on sale? Is it usually more than that for these guys? It's all the same guy. Okay. Five bucks? No. Nine bucks for that. Oh. I think my nephews are into these. Not sure. I have to check on that. Alright, that's it for clearance. These are new. <laughs> Ten bucks. Black Series, nothing new. They do have a fin over here, just chilling. And they do have a Borg that you could put on your car. I like that. Now that I've seen the movie, I get it, and I love the Wookiee roar. Where are the Nanos? Where are the Nanos? What? 
the Funko Pops. Everything's missing. I've got something up there. I can barely see it. I don't know what this is all about here. Huh. Can't really get to anything. It's too high up. These are like, these are some pretty high up shelves actually. They extended the shelves so that I can't get to them anymore. They're on to me. Smart move. Walmart, smart move. Is that Sergeant Body Slam? Isn't that his name? Yes, no, no, Sergeant Slaughter, that's it. Not Sergeant Body Slam. Sergeant Body Slam was something else. Okay. Rampage the movie. They got the lizard. They've got the wolf, a lobo. Y atrás, el chango también. Sorry, I think chango. Chango's monkey. I can't remember. Tal vez sirve. Bunch of uh, new um, Transformers. Or at least stocked Transformers here. These are all 16.82. These guys are 10 bucks. I'm gonna get a copyright over this song, and I don't have never even heard it. This one's the same guy all the way back. That's cool. Only at Walmart? There's the nanos, let's see. Uh, no restock action on the nanos, and I don't see any I can't live without except for him. I want him by himself. I want the Green Goblin in his ugly sculpt. I just love it. Okay, they've got the man beetle. Tech suit and uh, I can't remember which Spider-Man that is. Galactic. <laughs> oh, they got the wave, do they? No, they don't. Okay. That's cool to see. Mm. No black bolt though. It's cool to see the uh, Invincible Spider, uh, Iron Man though. Cool. <laughs> Multiverse. Wow, quite a bit of an uh, atom, huh? haven't really moved too much. Still got a Lando. Okay. Yeah. Nice. Wow. Same as the other one though. I figured since I'm getting into the infinity figures, might as well come over to this area and see what they have, which, that is it. I'm at five below, just so you know.
Wow. Ooh. Five bucks for him. If you're into him, that is a pretty good deal. I don't see much of him anymore. Oh, man. That's cool. This place is cool. It's my first time in a uh, Five Below, by the way. Hot Wheels, they got everything here. Awesome. Seems like a lot of him, a lot of uh, Rick Flag. That's cool. At Marshall's now. Mm. This store is very random. I think it's like the leftovers from the holidays. I think that is going to be it for here. All right, well, that's Marshall's. That is Marshall's. I had a friend stop by my client's uh, daughter and she made me this necklace. This is awesome. It's got the. Uh, yeah, Hungarian colors on it. That's pretty cool. Uh, anyways, uh, first of all, I just want to tell everybody, really sorry about not being able to get a video out as quick as I wanted to. It is um, those, you know, uh, okay, I know I've mentioned it numerous occasions, but I'm a personal trainer, and um, being that, this is the time of the year where it gets kind of busy, and I'm all over the place, and uh, just not really able to get to as many places as I could before. But I am gonna finish this hunting video today. We're gonna go hunt around, it's Sunday, see what we can find. But again, you know, very sorry about that. Please have patience with me. Um, things will get back to normal. Homeostasis will go back and we'll be good to go soon, okay? So let's go hunt, let's see what we can find. Probably gonna try to find some uh, Walgreens or something like that, all right? Walgreens. Bunch of daredevil. Still twenty dollars. Quite a bit of him. That's cool. The Marvel Legends are just like scattered everywhere. And then there's C3PO back there. C-3PO, Death Trooper, cool. Second Walgreens. Oh, they have a Commander Cody back there. See the Commander Cody? Sorry. Nice. 
That's cool. First time I've seen him. No chase. Oh, ho, ho. that's cool. Well, it fits. I definitely didn't do the worst to it. They got quite a few of this guy. Um, a whole bunch all the way to the back. Crazy. And then one Green Ranger with a horrible box. Alright, there's the legends. Do have a Punisher, that's cool. Pretty cool to see the Commander Cody. Box is pretty good too. Ronald Reagan Boulevard and SR 434. This is the Walgreens I'm at in uh, Longwood, or it's, I believe this is Longwood, not Castleberry. But anyways, um, just letting you know in case anybody's looking for that that Iron Patriot door, because that is the first time I've actually seen it in the store. Really, really, uh, really cool orb. So, yeah. And then they also have Commander Kobe, and I believe that was the the medic bot. That's what it's called, something like medical bot, something like that. But anyways, they only had one of those, and then the beat up green Power Ranger. So, yeah, cool. All right, Walgreens, last one, last hunt of the video. Let's see what they got. A lot of Punisher. It's like the case for everybody though, right? It's been a while since I've seen this guy. They got two of them. They got a Kylo in the back, C-3PO. Alright. These guys are still sitting here. Boxes are getting beat up. Ooh, Luigi. That is cool. Looks like they had the uh, new wave. Okay, cool. K2SO. I guess everybody's getting the Iron Patriot in. That is awesome. This is cool to see. That's really cool. I have never seen that one. Pretty neat. This dude right here, I got him already. If you uh, don't know, I, my sister picked him up for me. But that is a must. If you're into dorbs. Oops. Ugh. See, no good deed goes unpunished. 
try to fix one, drop more. All right, that's it for here. Oh, moving some stuff around, and wow, it's hard to hard to get some lighting in on this, but it's when you start like moving your collection around and stuff is when you realize like how much stuff you've accumulated. I mean, this is one box here, another box here. This is even the pops drawer full of legends right here. <laughs> I mean, yeah, get into a place where I can put all this stuff in one place, you know what I mean? Put it in one area so it can get the uh so it can get the proper treatment it deserves, not you know, boom, closed up in here. Hi. Yeah, that's pretty good. I rearranged everything. I hope you like it. I really do. I put a lot of work actually. No joke. A lot of work trying to get that set up. And things that I remember that I hate about Mystery Minis. But look, see? Oh, the pups! Pups. So, he's annoying. Right there. I think it's the white run. White run guard. Arrow to the knee. I don't know if you can see that, but this dude. I can't remember. I played the game Evil Within, but this guy right here, he is the most annoying. Anybody who has this, you already know why he's annoying. You already know. Pause, comment below. Why? Okay, unpause, whatever. He's annoying because he doesn't stand up. I hate him. He doesn't stand up and it drives me crazy. Um, he doesn't do a good job of standing up either. And uh, out of the mystery minis, actually, this one, not that value is important to me because I love them. I love them all. But this guy's actually shot the heck up in value. Now, I know there's mystery minis out there that are going like hundreds of dollars and stuff like that. But I just got this one. I used my rewards points off of GameStop when you could buy like material things at one time. And I think I got it for 3,500 points shipped to me. And uh, I got him. It was a GameStop power up exclusive. And, uh, you know, he's, he's like pushing like $30 or something. I was like, what are we talking about? My, 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 uh, cyber demon. Holy crap. But this is a really cool figure. I hope you guys had a chance to get them. I actually posted, uh, when they were still up, I got, well, I was doing my YouTube channels when that was still happening. Kind of run down the line here. And obviously there's a whole, there's two layers deep on these three layers actually on some of them. Right up into here, it's, it's three layers, but um, yeah. So I'm gonna show you really quick some of the pops. All the way down. Yeah. Ah. Oh my. My stand like straight up rejected my phone just now. That was awesome. I have a lot of issues and this stand was supposed to fix that. Uh, anyways, so I'm gonna. That's gonna be it for this video. Um, a lot of things have happened over the weekend, and um, that I, I've been. I saw on the Syndicate channel. One of them is that the the um, the Marvel Legend uh, Deadpool wave. I can't remember exactly which ones are in there, but I know there's a Deadpool in there. So that that that's happening. And um, there's a couple other there's a couple other things happening with these. I think that um, I saw. Marvel Legends are going for like $12.99 right now, and that's not just the Vintage Wave. That should be all of them, I believe, and I think Black Series might be as well, I think. But go check your Walgreens out. That's where it's supposed to be at. So I hope everybody has good luck with that. I definitely want to see what this new Marvel Legend Wave looks like. I think it's going to be... I think it's going to be awesome. I want to see it. I want to see it. Uh, anyway, so that's going to be it for right now, though. Um, I hope that I hope that everybody's doing really good. Again, I'm very sorry about not being able to get a video out lately, and I really appreciate the patience. I and 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 just I definitely wanted to. I wanted to film, but the stuff with the personal training, New Year's resolutions, getting commitments, commit commitment commitments, the commitments. That's right. And also I had to do video auditions at night. But anyway, so all that stuff going on kind of compiled throughout the week. And basically what I'm saying is I'm sorry, but I really appreciate the patience, everybody. Thank you so much. Again, I appreciate it. I feel the love. I love you all right back at you. This is, uh, 
this is what keeps this channel going is the fact that I get to talk to everybody and you know everybody just kind of is everybody's just really cool actually I just I could not ask for a better group of friends to sit here and communicate with um I really do mean that you all are awesome and I really appreciate everything with the support so enough of that uh that mushy stuff I know everybody's like Bleh. but anyways thank you so much I hope you are doing amazing I hope you had a wonderful time hunting this weekend my sister is going to be sending me a um some type of mystery box she said that it's world of nintendo figures I've never seen before so I traded her a couple of figures for a Mario Builder fi the the no Mario uh Builder Mario because I can't find it so she's trading me for that for some other figures and she said she found some stuff today, World of Nintendo figures, she's sure I've never seen before. So I am like, okay, I'm really curious about that because as y'all know, World of Nintendo is my stuff. I love it. Um, yeah, but I hope everybody had a wonderful time hunting this weekend. Five Below, first time I went to it, I love it. I can see the potential. I hope I run into some Marvel Legends next time I go there. All right, that's it. Happy hunting. Later.